Uh, we have lots of questions. Um, this one says, how do we define necessary? Is it by observing all the instances of its existence and then deeming that existence cannot, be, cannot happen otherwise? If that is so, doesn't that mean that the necessary is passing into the realm of customary experience? So one of the definitions of the apple and of the conclusions of the apple is that they are independent of experience. And uh, that, that's how we make the distinction between things that are known by customary experience and things that are known by apple. Things that are known by apple do not require laboratories. They do not require um, historical knowledge. They require only the examinations of meanings and propositions. Uh, this is the way that numbers work. This is the way that quantities works, work in geometry, uh, designs, and things like that. So uh, necessity is independent of experience. And the categories of the intellect are before experience. They are the means by which we understand experience. Um,